guys welcome back to world's illuminate 11 on this friday i hope you're having a great day and welcome if it is your first time checking out my channel and if it is your first time checking out the channel then please do hit the subscribe button you are very welcome here so this is the weekly divine masculine message for any divine masculines who may come across this video at some point if you do at that point this is a message for you a message of love and support from the angels or for any divine masculines who watch the channel so we're bringing in three decks today we're going to see what the angels would like you to know starting with your guardian angel message from your guardian angel using the guardian angel cards so thank you angels what message is coming through for the divine masculines today what message is coming through for the divine masculines and then we're bringing in as well messages from your angels so thank you angels what messages are coming through for the divine masculines and then we'll finish off with some messages from the Divine Masculine Power Messages. So thank you, angels. What messages are coming through for the Divine Masculines um, on this day? What messages are coming through for the Divine Masculines on this day? Okay, so the cards that came out from your guardian angels, we get two cards. So the first card that came out is love. Really beautiful message. And it says, negative thoughts and feelings are sabotaging your pursuit of happiness. We, your angels, are here to help you heal. Allow our healing light to flow through your heart, conscious, through, through, flow through your heart. Consciously infuse each negative thought or feeling with love and light. Feel both your heart and mind aligning to your soul's sacred purpose and unleash your divine potential through the power of love. What a beautiful message to come through for you today, um, Divine Masculine, from your angels, reminding you that any negative thoughts and feelings that you may be having, you know, whether it is about making certain changes in your life, you know, moving forward towards your Divine Feminine, uh, moving towards your mission, whatever those negative thoughts are, you know, feeling that you can't do certain things and, you know, whatever those negative thoughts and fears that are coming up for you, you know, they are sabotaging your pursuit of happiness they're stopping you from doing the things that you're truly wanting to do and really going for finding your happiness in your life so you're being asked to work on releasing those negative thoughts and feelings and it says we your angels are here to help you so you're not doing this alone invite the angels in and they will help you to release those negative thoughts and feelings allow our healing light to flow through your heart so feel that healing light that comes through from the angels and let it flow through your heart and then consciously infuse each negative thought or feeling with love and light so the angels are helping you to consciously work on releasing the negative thoughts infusing them with love and light and turning them into positive into positive thoughts as well so feel both your heart and mind aligning to your soul's sacred purpose. So, you know, that's about you. When you release the fears, when you are working on filling your heart with love and with light and, you know, and your feelings and your thoughts with love and light, then that helps you to align more to your sacred purpose because you have a purpose for being here. And, you know, and the fact that you are letting the negative thoughts come in and, you know, take over and the feelings that uh, negative negative thoughts and feelings that are sabotaging your pursuit of happiness, the fact that you're letting them take over and, you know, stopping you from doing the things that you are wanting to do is actually sort of keeping you away from moving forward and aligning to your sacred purpose. So it's about you releasing those negative thoughts and feelings. And then when you do that, you unleash your divine potential through the power of love. So there is so much that you can do when you focus on love and release the negativity, release the fears, and really focus on love operating from your heart in everything. So really beautiful message. And the next card that came out is positive change. And it says, dare to be different. When you are criticized, remember that you will never please everyone. Many brilliant and gifted individuals were not fully appreciated or understood in their own lifetime. Yet it is often they yet it is often they who have shown the seeds of change. Yes, yet it is yes, yet it is often they who have sown the seeds of change. So the message that's really coming through here is for you to be dare to be different. You know, to not follow the crowd, what other people are doing, what you know a society has taught you told you that you should do. Dare to be different, follow your heart, operate from love, do the things that you're wanting to do. 
and you know and when you're not criticized when you are criticized by other people remember that you can't please everyone but it is about you doing things to put yourself first the things that are coming through from your heart and soul the things that you truly want to do as well and you're being reminded that many brilliant and gifted individuals you know they weren't understood or appreciated by others at first you may be wanting to walk your own path but the fears are coming in because no one else is or your friends are walking that path or maybe your family will not understand but you know it's not about the other people your path is your path and it's your path to walk alone so you're being asked to do everything from the heart, operate from love and go on your own path and do the things that you are being guided to do from within. And, you know, and it is often that those who did their own thing are actually the people who brought in positive change when it comes to, to the world. So you're being shown that when you walk your own path, you know, that is going to help you to really do what you, you know, what you are being guided to do and part of your sacred purpose. And, you know, and and that's about you bringing change as well. So you're being asked here to really operate from love and move forward to making positive change of be daring to be different and walking your own path to the life that you truly desire, whether that is towards love or, you know, towards your mission, you know, moving forward towards your sacred purpose, your life purpose, move forward and do the things that you're being guided to do from within. That's the message that's coming through for you today. And then the cards that came out from the uh, angels, from your angels, the first one is Archangel Raphael. And Archangel Raphael is saying to you, Divine Masculine, I'm helping you heal physical challenges in yourself and others you are a healer like me so you're being shown here that you are a healer as well like archangel raphael and you start off by working on healing yourself and archangel raphael is helping you to heal yourself and as you heal yourself you can be able to move forward as well to actually then be able to heal others whether that is through energy healing you know actually healing others or you know if from your words and you know the things that you do as well when you move forward to actually walking your path to do the things that you are here to do so you are here to heal others in whatever way that is for you and but that is about you daring to be different and taking the path that you feel you're being guided to take and letting go of any fears and negative thoughts and feelings that try to come in the way of doing that and then the next card that came out for you is mystique and it says keep charging ahead and don't take no for an answer expect miraculous solutions to appear so really powerful you know like that horse there that is going forward you're being asked to keep charging ahead you know even if other people may not understand the path that you're on keep charging ahead don't take no for an answer don't worry about what other people think keep going forward and then expect miraculous solutions to appear because as you're moving forward on your path you know towards your sacred purpose uh, or doing your sacred purpose the universe is there to help you the angels are there to help you so you will expect to see miraculous solutions appear when you are moving forward on your path and then the next card that has come out for you is adriana and it says i am leading you towards the answer to your prayers please listen to and follow the steps i am communicating through your intuition thoughts and dreams. So you're being shown here that the angels are guiding you. You're not doing your path alone. So listen to those messages that are coming through from within. They are coming in to help you on your path. And you know, to, so listen to the messages that are coming through from your intuition, uh, messages coming through from your dreams as well. They are helping you to move forward towards where you're truly meant to be, whether that is in love, you know, or in other areas of your life towards your mission, changing your career, whatever that is for you the life that you are dreaming of you are being guided so listen to those messages that are coming through from within and then the last card that came out for you is akasha and it says you are a spiritual teacher you have the ability to counsel others and help them awaken their spiritual gifts and divine life mission so divine masculine you're being shown here that you are here to 
do something that is powerful which is about healing others you know with the other cards that came out or being a spiritual teacher you know so in whatever way that is for you you're actually here to walk your path that's why you're getting all that guidance to really sort of dare to be different to walk and your path towards your sacred purpose because you are actually here to be able to teach others you know and that's why you're being guided on this path and messages are coming through for you so that you follow that path so you're being shown here is that it's a matter of you moving forward you know charge forward with whatever guidance that you are getting because it is helping you to get to where you are meant to be so that you can then be able to counsel and help others awaken their spiritual gifts and divine life mission so you are being guided towards your mission on your path and the message is for you to listen to that guidance that is coming from within let go of any fears and keep moving forward and then the cards that came out for you from um the the divine masculine power messages so the first one that came out is put yourself first so the angels are saying divine masculine put yourself first you know don't worry about other people put yourself first if you need to make certain changes in your life do that for yourself if you are wanting to walk a certain path that is leading you to, to your purpose for being here, then do that. Put yourself first. Don't worry about what family or other people or your friends will think. You know, put yourself first. Listen to your heart. You know, make the changes that you're wanting to make so that you can move forward towards, you know, where you're truly wanting to be as well. And the last card that came out for you is it will be worth it. So whatever you do in putting yourself first, know that it will be worth it because it's going to lead you to that life that you truly desire. So put yourself first. It will be worth it. Let go of any fears and negative thoughts and, you know, things that are stopping you from walking the path that you're being guided to walk. And know that when you release all that and you operate from love and you move forward on your path, it will be worth it. So I really hope you have a great day, guys. I'll see you on the last, uh, on the next video. Love, peace, positivity, and light.